Oh, it was a pretty scary sight here. This is all that's left of Los Albertos. Police say that the owners are actually lucky to be alive. Looking at this now, they were inside of here. A truck came off of the road, swerved into it, hit it, and it really just leveled this place. Los Albertos is a small town favorite nestled here in the town of Wellington. Today's a big day. She does uh, amazing pasoli on Wednesday. So I was looking forward to coming down here as usual. But this morning, the walls came crashing down. It was a very violent crash. Police say a semi truck was making its way into town around 6 30 this morning. The driver going too fast for conditions. As the vehicle came into uh, a slight corner, the truck then impacted some uh, slush and snow. The snow and slush sent the semi crashing into the Mexican food favorite. The owners were still inside. Uh, the male owner was able to get out of the building. First trooper on scene was able to. Uh, identify that the female was trapped inside. Uh, then he did make entry and he was able to recover her out of the building before the building became more unstable. Police say the accident could have been a lot worse, but for Jasmine and many others in the community, Los Albertos was a crown jewel in Wellington. I love the food here. The people are great. Not even two hours after the accident took place, a community member started this GoFundMe page. Before you know it, the, everybody jumped in in action to try to help. The page filled with locals and visitors sending their best and donations. I hope that they that they get better. This is a strong community right here, and I know that everybody will chip in and volunteer and do what they need to do to see them back on their feet as a family and as a business. Yeah, you know, miraculously enough, everybody that was involved in this only sustained minor injuries. So the couple and the truck driver, they were all taken to the hospital. We've been in touch with the family of the owners. They say they've been released and they're back home recovering right now. They are currently trying to get this truck out of here. You can actually see them lifting it. This is the first time they've been doing this all day. We do have a quick update for you as well. One lane of traffic in each direction has just now been opened on US 6. So things are flowing in here. Looks like they are making some progress on getting this truck out, which, like I said, this is the first time they've really been moving it or trying to move it at all since we've been here. Live in Wellington, L. Thomas, Fox 13 News.